Good morning, sleepy friends, and welcome to the last day of attempting to buy all my groceries and little treats by busking full time for seven days. My belly is full now. We can start doing things. Time to skip. Hey guys, what's up? So I'm ready to go on the street now, but first let's see the expenses that I had in the last two days while I was in my part-time job and I couldn't go for busking because I also have a real life, guys, if I didn't tell you. So we were at a total of 265 and 56 euros. But on Thursday, I went to buy some water and a pack of lattes for 3 euros and 69 cents. And then on Friday, I went to buy some coffee for me and a friend and I spent 6 euros and 75 cents. And then for the break during my job, I had a banana and was only 18 cents. So today, we are at a total of 264 euros and 84 cents. I know that today is going to be rainy. I would probably stay at home today, okay? But because I want to give you the real experience, I just want to show you what it's like if you end up on the street and it starts raining at some point while I am busking. So let's go on the street and let's start with the first set of busking. Just tuned in, you should know that we are on the seventh day of a full-time busking series where they raise money to donate to help link mental health in Ireland, whose mission is to provide accessible, free or low-cost mental health services, seven days a week and out of hours. Links and incentives are in the description. Hey guys, I just arrived here in front of Eason's. Of course there are no buskers around on the street because it is a little bit rainy as you can see from people. They're having like their umbrella and their raincoats. It is actually also warm so it's not that cold so it's a strange weather today and, and I am already sweating. Yeah, let's give it a go. It's actually not raining that much today and if it is like this it's great because my stuff doesn't get that wet. And also there wouldn't be other buskers around, so a lot of music on the street. Which is good if you want to make a little bit of money and if you don't have a lot of competition on the street. If you are the only one busker, you probably end up having all of the tips that people are going to give in that day. So every day is, is different, so let's see how it goes. The weather won't beat me. I am here to beat the weather. Yeah. Okay. when you're in the rain so I just passed only for 20 minutes and I already had to stop so let's see if we can go on or not let's just wait a little bit the guitar case is open but it's already wet let's see if while I am busking it stops raining I will keep going but if it's Thing raining after like five minutes. I would probably stop because otherwise the guitar case would be like very wet. Okay, let's try. Stop the clock, she's amazing You should see the 
I needed to go to the toilet, guys. But luckily, Brandon was around, and he started playing a few songs. Brandon is playing a few tunes. Somebody to leave. That's way. It was at this moment that someone in the crowd was about to do the most incredible thing you have ever seen. The prettiest little girl started dancing for 10 minutes straight while Brandon was playing. I mean, have you ever seen anything more incredible than this? I bet you haven't. I'm just going to get my meal deal and then rock my stuff again. Go for the second set. Hey guys, you guys here we are again. This is the last day of the series and we are still here. In dance. So get the meal deal with the roll and the can of 7-Up. Can I have a chicken roll? Like a white roll. Thanks. Hey guys. I just finished the lunch here and I'm heading back now to catch up with Brandon who is still singing on the street. What I, what I was saying, yeah, that Baskin for this week I have learned a lot of things. I learned how you actually can get very tired after two or three days busking full time and that you need to rest to recover your vocals and your throat, to rest your throat. It's a natural thing to be tired after busking full time for three, four days and it's not worth it just to keep busking on the street if you are sore in your throat. Now, if you want to start busking, just do your thing. Go on the street, go for a set, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, just try it out and see if you like it. And then if you like it, just keep doing it. And then upgrade your stuff. And then just go on and don't stop and conquer the world. I'm kidding. I'm just I'm just saying, just just do what you like. That's all guys. I'm heading back to see Brandon again. Okay, it's raining and Brandon asked me to go and buy an E string for the guitar. It should be like two euros. So let's go to the music shop and see if they have it. How much is? Brandon! I'll just drop this here. Hey guys, I just moved to this place that is at the end of Key Street after Shop Street, but it's raining a lot. I don't know if you can see it now. Yeah, you probably can see. So we just wait a little bit for busking again and just give it like uh, maybe five, ten minutes before starting to bus. But the weather won't beat me. It is raining so much now. The weather is beating me. And so I had an idea. My idea was to come here to bask under the Spanish arch, which is this arch. But there is already a man who is basking there, so I'm not gonna be able to play there. The place is too small, too, too small to bask there, so I will just wait a little bit until the rain is gone. You're here in the Spanish arch in Galway. And we have Olaf here who is playing the whistle. And you're from Germany, right? I'm from Northern Germany. Nor Northern Germany, yeah, yeah, yeah. Olaf, for how long have you been busking? I'm just here for eight days. Mm -hmm. For eight days, I'm just going out here for busking to and uh, go uh, traditional, um, deeper in traditional Irish music in the pubs in the late afternoon and uh, in the night. I sell my CDs here. All of us have CDs. I have CDs and I'm a composer from Germany and a tin whistle player and it is very Irish. People like to have an album and people, you can talk with people about the album. If only they put their coins, it's okay, but you, usually they don't talk to you. 
Mm -hmm. But if you have an album or something like that, it looks more professional, it looks more you are more settled in music. Yeah, that's great. That's really a good tip for someone who wants to start basket. Maybe when you start for the first times, you don't have anything, you just have your instrument and you just want to play some music. Okay, but then yeah. later Charger when you learn... You burn a CD with your songs. I miss that. Yeah. And yes. that's easy. Yeah. Yeah. Because you learn, I think that's we call it some charm. tracks, maybe <laughs> find cover. That's really this good. Is not to be too professional, it's okay. Just have something. Okay, okay. Have something. That's a good tip, Olaf. Thank you so much okay. for your time. And uh, I leave you playing more the whistle in this rainy day in Galway. Okay, thank you thanks, much. thanks a lot, thank you. Okay guys, I'm ready to bask, but I think this is not one of the best spots because it is at the end of the main street, so there is a lot of people coming from that side who they just want to get into the main street, go to the shops, go to the pubs, and that's what they do first. They don't really think about, oh, I want to listen to that musician. At least this is what I think. So it is not like, this is not like the best spot to bask, but I was here close to the river, so I just decided to stay here. A lot of things are already wet. The amp is already wet, the guitar is a bit wet, the guitar case is a little bit wet. So I will just start now. Talking to the sunbird yesterday Flew me to a place not far away She's a little pilot probably see it is still raining so it didn't stop I was waiting like for five minutes so I think I'm just packing up everything and going home and I will just stop here unfortunately when the weather is not on your side this is the only thing you can do or you find like a sheltered place or you just go home what an amazing seven days guys! Being a full-time busker can be very demanding. You must carry your gear with you and always depend on the weather. But at the same time, it is gratifying and you get so much love from the people. And this can make your day special if you are a full-time busker. And now let's wrap up the numbers for this final day. On the first busking set, I made 70 euros and 65 cents with the help from Brandon. Then I had lunch for 3 euros and 95 cents. At the end of the second set, I made 26 euros and 20 cents. I also bought some tea for 3 euros and 90 cents and ginger from my throat for 85 cents. At the end of this big adventure, we raised a total of 289 euros and 99 cents. What's the problem, man?
Bro, do a little check in me. Hello, how's it going? Do you have any tips for who wants to start to busk for the first time? Just go grab your amp, grab your guitar, and go in the street. You'll yeah. never be nervous to start. The more you enjoy it, the better you'll come across. But if you have an album, it looks more professional, it's more settled in music. Just fucking do it. People generally, most people don't care. Like, even if you're shy, it doesn't matter. It's good not to take it too personally, then, yeah. whether yeah. you make money or not. I've been listening to Dolly for about a year now, who's here? I started the fiddle when I was... That's the way the cookie crumbles. Thank you guys for watching. Before I go, I just wanted to say thanks to all the street performers who shared their tips and thoughts about Buskin. Guys, this is it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you with the next one.